try to tie. <laughs> it, it, we were trying to basically pray for uh, pray for a miracle, but you know they're a good team. Again, um, we had some guys that couldn't make it because of school. Rolling up with seven guys, one of our guests didn't show. It happens. Well, um, I honestly think uh, with the Rio side being a big cluster um, that it is, we thought there'd be more aggressive pushing down on that side. We tried having that, but we stalled out a little bit because once we got up there, they had um, beast guys had their guns up just cutting us down. Um, we tried to be snake dominant, but again, they would clip one of our guys trying to get to snake side and that just, it doesn't, it doesn't help. You can't play man down right off the bat. Yeah. So we had a little trouble with some angles and it doesn't help that we only have seven guys. Well, I have to admit that the Canadian reps and the, the, the organization itself, I think has been a highlight. But overall, we had a fun time traveling out here, Montreblanc, uh, uh, Montreal. Um, it's great, it's great. Well, Pat, he, him, he's really the best. You know, all the things he does for us, puts money for us. He's always there every Tuesday, every Saturday. He'll always be at the practice. He's always first one there, opening the doors up for us. He does everything for us. You know, if we're missing money, he has, he'll always have money for us. And since he gives us so much, all we have to do to get back to him is just come out and win games. We're bottom rung, man. We're bottom rung. The thing is that we got to pull off, uh, again, playing against Laval, trying to see if we, if we can try to pull off a miracle again, which isn't going to happen, uh, in my opinion. But if we tie, we might have a chance to not get regulated down to, or relegated down to MXL. But if we don't, uh, this franchise becomes the MXL franchise.